Welcome back into Icarus. Uh, we are looking at the Riverlands now. We've got all this stuff done. I think we're all the way up to... Yeah, we finished off those. I think there was supposed to be a new quest back here. Yep. Resisted... Uh, assisted Stockpile. So this is just a case of going back and showing you how to go into caves and collect ores. Um, I might do that at some point when I want to just do a quickie, you know, throw up something that's probably like 10 minutes long. <laughs> but we're going to go over here and do this, the incursion scan. So I got seven days to do this. It's going to be 200 units of money. Oh, uh, what, what are they? I don't even remember what they call this stuff anymore. But 200 cash. And uh, I'm looking here. Operator put. So we're going to put down surveys, scanners, probably going to attract critters. So I'm going to want to build up. Let's go ahead and claim this. Um, we haven't built on anything new yet. Uh, we're per, Right now we're just buying the schematics. So we've got all the things we want. We're going to go in with an ad lift for additional weight. We're going to do this for additional speed for the mass dampener. We're going to take the gatherer's backpack to help with the, uh, the primarily the ores. It makes a world of difference. We're going to have both the uh, O2 tank and the uh, water canteen. We we're going to take in our shoey knife and the basic MXC pickaxe is pretty much just a stone axe. Confirm that loadout. Let's go ahead and get down there and see what we got. And we're here. All right, let's take a look here and see what we got. We'll take all this. Oh, look, they even get a radar? Okay. Water. Knife. There we go. All right. First one's marked on my map, you say. Oh, we're up in the, yeah, we are in the Riverlands, aren't we? This is like the uh, waterfall area here, isn't it? Well, let's grab a few rocks, a few sticks, a few, a few uh, things. Start crafting away. So the first things I'm going to want to get here, I'm going to want to get myself an axe. Uh, can I get the bow yet? What do I need? More sticks and more more thatch. Fiber. Hey, look, it's food. We're going to need some rocks here for the arrows. At least for the initial set of arrows. Okay, and let's go ahead and eat one of these. Zoom. Grab myself a bow. Grab myself a, a bow. Grab myself. I don't probably don't need that. Eh, sure, why not? We'll go ahead and grab the 14. And let's swap these two things. All right, next. No piggy piggy. What? What the hell? Seriously. Okay. You. Let's get this because we want to get the bone. I think the very first thing I want to do is get a uh, bone shiv. Did I do that yet? What do I need? Wood. Hey, guess what? Got one of those too. Got that. Okay. And then I can do bone arrows. A bone arrow? Seriously? Wow. Horrible. Horrible. I'm going to take a look at my map. Where is my. Okay, got one there, one there, and one up north. We're going to go ahead. Yeah. 
is this the uh yeah that's where i put my scanner in the the original you know have to get in here and dig yeah i have to climb the wall all right so we're gonna go ahead and grab this i'm gonna go up and take a look Ooh, nice i like that one time shot thing uh no i don't really need the sulfur just yet what do we got over here bison a bison and a baby bison nice yourself let's come around man oh that's different let's uh, eat that okay so i headed up there i have to go north do i want to build out this is kind of central right here why? Well, you're running away. Okay, good. That's fine. As long as you're running away and not at me, I think I'm good. Do I, like I said, do I want to do a base, go to cobble, or do I just want to crank this thing out? <sighs> you know, I might. Grab the sulfur so that I have uh, this for the oxygen dissolver. I think I go across. What do we got down this way? That's a nice view. I kind of like the view. And I could also do a... F I could do a base off of that right there. In the middle of the water. I wonder if that would be like defensive. That would be great. Nice, nice kill. Good amount of stuff. Yeah, I think I will. I'm going to go ahead and build up a base. I'm going to build it like right over here. A lot of flat area here, so I think it'll be fine. Be back in a few. All right, our little uh, two by two is done. I've got the uh, crafting bench, the, the rebelism bench. I've got the forge ready to go. Got my spawn point, my fire, and my oxygen. So everything is set up to go. I, I slipped through the night. I've got a stack, a couple of stacks still left of wood, and uh, quite a few stacks of stone, which will be pretty good. I think. Man, I'm not mistaken, just over the corner here, there should be a should be a, 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 a thing down here. Where's the thing? Okay, I should be able to come down here to peek, right? Let's try the, ooh, silica. Yes, please. All right, well, I'm going to keep going. I'll, be get, I'll get back to you right after I do cobble. All right, well, I'm back here in, in my uh, my cobblestone house. I've expanded it by uh, a two by one there, so that's, now it's a total of two by three. Uh, I have put down the a masonry bench and the anvil as well while we've been doing that because I have to do that to get to the cobble. Um, the next thing we're looking at doing is getting up into epoxy, some stone. Um, I have, I don't have any epoxy done. I don't have any epoxy done. But we'll go ahead and craft some. There we go. That should, that should get us in epoxy for a little while. Uh, now that we've got that done, uh, while I was here, and just after I got, I think before I got the cobblestone down once, I had a bear come in from that way. And after I got the cobblestone down, I had a bear come in from that way. And then I had these guys come over and start attacking. Uh, the wolf I expected. The, uh, the emu thingy, I, I, I did not. I did not expect the moment to come over and start attacking. But he came over, he looked in the window, he stared at me for a couple of seconds there, and he went, I don't like it. <laughs> uh, okay. So we, we, we went through that. Uh, let's see. I am still needing to stock up a bit more on 
to uh, the stack of sticks. The more of the stack of sticks. More uh, bow and arrows. What is that? Ten more? Whatever. I'll put these back in. No. Bring that back. And we'll dump these off. All right. Let's go do the first one of these scans. It's going to be up north a bit, so we'll just start running up here. Um, I will, in between these things, do a little bit more work on the base there. Uh, my intent is to expand into... Uh, well, not, I don't want to, I don't think I'm going concrete. But I, well, I'll take some of these, too. I want to expand it, my, my thing into like a 3x4. Ideally, that'll take care of just about anything I might want to do. Uh, this is going to be good for, I think it's anticoagulant stuff. This is precise as the data gets. See what you can find. Oh, okay, sir, if you, if you so say so. Um, I think. I see a cave up there too. That might be handy. Do I have? I kind of have a high place over here if I want it. So I could go up there. What are you? You're moving a little bit too quick. You look like a dog. The movement is too dog like. Puppy? Nope, it's a boar. We got other guys too. I'm thinking I'm going to do something a little bit different. There you go. Stations online. Looks like the party started. Stay sharp. Did it? There's a deer. Is the deer mad at me? There's a problem with the machine. Can you fire it back up? Probably. Who's angry at it? Wolf? I'm going to take these guys because they'll give me some more arrows. And then we'll go fire that thing back up again. And of course we get ourselves a... Uh, Done here. Let's go grab this. Uh, X, pick it up. And we're all done with this. One down. Uh, let's go ahead and eat. All right. So next, I'm going to be heading back because we have to go all the way down to over there and here. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to go into this uh, cave up here, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, mine out what I can, and then I'm going to head back. Well, I have finished uh, making some stuff here, and I just made a, a recurve bow, so I got up to uh, the uh, cement furnace, con con shush, be with you in a second, concrete furnace and um, the, the cement mixer. I also spent a little bit of time over here, since I was doing stuff like that. I made a water trough, I made a food trough, and I made an animal bed, which looks kind of like this right here. Uh oh, am I out of food? Oh, I'm out of food. No! <laughs> I'm, out of, I'm doing good. What? 
Yeah, you hungry? You hungry? He says he's hungry. So, if you if you want, you take out a Moa with a with a baby. If you kill the the parent Moa, and there's no other parent Moas around, he'll just wander around. You can walk up and do an E on him, and you can try to tame him. I ran out of food. I ran out of food because I tamed him instead. Oh, he's hungry too. Can I? Uh, this is Rongo. Nice. Hello, Rongo. How you doing? Uh, can I put a? Let's try this again, Rongo. Come here. Uh, up here, right? There we go. And now I have a spot for food and water. Is that what I got up there? Oh. Uh, I, I, you know what? Oh, hello. <laughs> Me. Oh, oh. Nice. <laughs> All right. Well, let me try something else here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make myself a leather water thing. Water bottle. Water skin. I need some 12 leather. I think I've got some leather over here. Let's go make a water skin. Grab that. Okay. Put this away. Oh, he's, he's yelling at me. Now, now I'm I'm having this desire to, to do a uh, do some do a farm thing going on here. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Uh, can I? I can. And then, Rog Rogo, how do you feel about that? Rock Rock Rogo. About that. He is. I don't know how he feels about that. He says he's eighty-eight, and I gave him water. All right, so I have to be off him to take a look at this. Or is that just storage? It could be storage. What if I put this in my inventory and do this? An eight. Hey, hey, you. Nope. You don't like that? Can I come over here and get in the water? No. Uh, so how am I supposed to make sure you get water? Uh, is it just... By putting water in your trough? It probably is. I know I'm going to stick this water thing in here anyway. No, you know what I could do? Let's go eat. Yeah. Wait. Uh, press E to fill the trough. Okay. So it's full. So I just need to go find you food. Let's go. Uh, let's go find food. I am kind of curious to see if whether or not I can outrun a few things. Can I? He ate all the pumpkins that were in there before, so I think I could do pumpkins for him and his buddy and carrots. I know he likes carrots. I got the baby with me. The baby's following me around. I also don't know about uh, aggro. Do they do they fight for me? Can I just look at my own inventory? I can. Let's consume some food because I'm hungry. Uh, Daddy comes first. All right, let's so let's stick in here and. Anyway, angry. Are you happy now? Why aren't you happy? I'm going to hit the E to get him to stop following me. What about you? Well, oh, now he's happy. Okay. What about the water? What about the water? Right. He's still not happy. He's got food, right? No, he doesn't have food. <laughs> Rogo ate all this food. God damn. So, yeah, I, I guess you do have to get some uh, stuff going on. I just wanted to see how this thing would work out. All right, let's go ahead and do this. What time is it here? It is 1.40. Yeah, I think I probably have the time. Let's take Rongo and head out to the south. You're going to stay here and starve to death.
course, if I see some, uh, if I see some things along the way. Uh, you got stuck on a tree. What about fall damage? You don't really take fall damage, do you? So it's just carrots. Oh, so he does get tired. I don't, oh, there, okay, is it my stamina we're going off of? Or is his stamina I'm going off of? He does move at a decent clip even without my uh, sprint. It does seem kind of hard to pick out the uh, stuff on the ground, though. I made it over here to the other location, and of course it's raining and stuff. I'm going to go ahead and build, I think, or at least prep up maybe a small wood, you know, wood, uh, one by one, or even a two by two. Well, now that the, uh, the thing's passed, I had to go off and grab my mower. He ran off somewhere. Let's go ahead and drop this thing down and get it cooking. And touch it. Looks like Just waiting for something to arrive. I'm assuming that it's going to come from down this way. Okay, where? Is that the angry wildlife? Uh, there's a problem. Start, Start the unit back, back up or this is going, going nowhere. nowhere. Um, they can't get to me. Really sure what I what I pissed off down there, but it's something. Oh, I see. Okay, time to move out. There's another zone marked on your map. Okay, let's go look at this thing. I think I might have to fix it. That's just durability. It's fine. I see a carrot. So there he is. Give me my arrow back, you pig. Grab all my stuff. I might need to go back just to feed my my guy here, you know. We'll see. Well, we made it back to the uh, the base, and Ron goes out there chewing away. Let's go ahead and uh, take take a look in here. I don't really need that much more meat, so I will just toss a a stack I do use the bacon bacon I have a little bit of wood sure why not let's put that in there activate it um, I'm gonna go ahead and unload my miscellaneous here and then we're gonna sleep and then we're gonna head back out okay Nighttime now has passed. Let's go ahead and take a run, go back out. Oh, hey, how you doing, buddy? You're almost ready to go, aren't you? Yeah, you wandered off because there was no food. I don't blame you. 
Oh, Rago, you're you're doing good, right? Yeah, you're fine. Come on, Rago, let's move out of the way. All right, next one is going to be way out there. Let's give it a shot and see what happens. Well, I've made it to the last location. I just have to come across this pot. I spent a couple of minutes sitting up along the edge, just staring down here. Because this, this is sus. <laughs> this is so sus right now. Um, I got pigs. More pigs. What's... Yeah, see, this is like a dead end area back in here. I, I mean, just this just seems less than friendly. Um, I'm thinking, and they've got this thing placed kind of hidden in there. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build out a spot over, like, right over here. And I'm going to clear this all the way over to that spot there. So... I'm gonna take a moment and do all of that, but we're over here now at the uh, at the last location. Long run, um, definitely nice to have the moment. I, I am I am a I'm a fan. All right, I'll see you in a minute. Well, I have the two by two back up, and I put some spikes down. I actually spent a little bit, I made myself a little thing there, and uh, I actually made a little bit of a wall. Not really sure if it's a, a functional wall or not, but hey, you know, every little bit helps, right? Uh, we will stick out a couple more of these things just in case somebody wants to come around the back. Uh, and a couple in a spread out position there. Just in case. I uh, I don't know what to expect. I would expect bears from what I've seen so far, but I can't believe there's nothing really new in the in the Riverlands. There's got to be something new. So, and it just seems—it just seems like the game would throw it at me right here. Here we go. Good. Where are we in the station? It's active. I can even sneak here. That's great. Let me guess. Something's gonna get pissed off at me, right? Could be buffalo. Oh, man. That's That's some angry wildlife. What again? Bear. Multiple bears. Okay. Hey, doing there, bear? Uh, you step on something? <laughs> All right. And you? Let's clean them both up. Oh, I guess I'm hungry. And yeah, they came on pretty quick, didn't they? I don't think anything else is coming. But we'll sit here just in case. Okay, that's it. Good deal. Scans finished. We're clear. Job done. Uh, I want a few things here, though. Actually, I might as well take the whole thing with me. Just in case some nasty storm hits on the way home. Uh, I'll just take two. Well, put it on. Because you're done here. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Come here. Sheesh. All right, well, we're heading back. I'll meet you back at the bay, at the uh, ship, actually. We'll take off from there. I have nothing left in the base that I need to collect. Uh, the broken 
pickaxe I've already put back into the ship, and I did find in one cave a single boulder of exotic materials, which I also ate all of, which I put back in the in the uh, rocket. So we're we're good to go. Well, we're back at our rocket pod here. Our little hab return. Rongo, you've been great. Hey, come back here. Oh, oh. There you go. 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 See you later, buddy. Not sure why you're 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 taking damage now, but okay. Let's return to station. And we've completed. We got our two hundred, our two hundred clams. Uh, I also picked up eight exotics, so we'll take a, th both of those. Uh, in the workshop, I am still working on flying the rest of the stuff. So do I have it? I think I do. Yep. So I got all of it. Now I just start buying the pieces. And I can already get one piece. Just stick it in the in the hole. <laughs> the other thing I need to work on is getting this pickaxe up to something that's actually worth a damn. But I'm gonna need a thousand points. Two hundred fifty. Well, I got the, I got kind of got the exotics. I'm gonna have to go on an exotic run at some point, or hang out, grab it. What do I need? 250? Yeah, I need 250 on the exotics. I have it. I need 50. I need 250 on the cash. I don't have that. All right. Let's go back. Next mission. So we finished the live scan, the live terrain scan. I think I'm going to go, of course, a round robin on a difficulty, you know, going from basically the easiest to the hardest. Uh, where are we? Where are we here? So it looks like a wilderness exploration for 30 days. Is this the, this, is this the land to come back up thing? It is. You know what? Let's get the check mark. Welcome to Dexter's uh, Airlines. We are going to be arriving on Icarus into the Riverlands. Please, everybody, we don't have that much time. Just go ahead and get on out and take your pictures. Please, one at a time. One at a time, please. There's all the stuff. Oh, look. Pretty. Oh, pretty. Nice. Look at the pretty stuff. Oh, look, and then I've got un everything's unlocked here. All the stuff. Yeah, actually, very pretty. Okay, everybody, we got to get going. Very busy day. Let's leave. Right? Awesome. Okay, so. <laughs> uh, that was kind of funny. All right, so anyway, uh, we went down in and got that mission done so we did the incursion scan uh nowhere near seven days i think i, I got that done in a, a definitely under a day uh we teched up to actually get to tech level two barely uh to get the the, the what was that is that a recurve bow i think it was a recurve bow we got and uh really the biggest thing is just that there's a lot of travel so uh you're gonna have to carry a, a house on your back just to make sure that you can get past any of the storms that come in and you can also use the house in your back as a hunting blind i think the it's the first time i've tamed a moa and i'm certainly happy with it uh i did outrun one bear uh, i had a bear run into me on the way to the third site and uh it, he uh he, he cut off pretty quick so I don't know if that's the case of I had enough speed or if it was because I was on a MOA, uh, my aggro radius is much smaller. I think that might actually be the case. I had a dog try to attack me at one point in time. 
Uh, he growled. He turned around. And he ran after me for like a, a, literally three seconds and stopped. So um, I think there's also the advantage of being able to navigate through some hostiles with the MOA, which probably warrants a little bit more investigation. Uh, but all that worked out pretty well. Uh, I haven't run into anything new as far as critter wise. So we're dealing with uh, boars and bears and wolves. Oh my. So the next one that we're going to go through, because we just, we just did the exploration is probably this uplift bio research. Yeah. It looks like we're going to be doing uplift bio research next. So come back and join me. Take care. Bye-bye. Creeping through the shadows and the corners of your mind. I go where the wind blows. I run, but I don't hide. I hear the call of the wild whispering the name. No, I can't be tamed. My heart belongs to the night. I'm alone, I'm alone, I'm alone. I'm a lone wolf I'm a lone wolf I'm a, I'm a, 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 I'm a, I'm a